Hello, my name is Warren Hill and I'm a product specialist at Gaskell. Gaskell, in an effort to better educate our customers and add additional value, has developed a best practices training series. Our intentions are to better explain, better educate, and to ensure a helpful understanding of what gas regulators are and discuss their normal operation. Gasco represents three major manufacturers of combustion gas regulators. They are Census Metering Systems, Pietro Fiorentini, and Maxitrol. In this series, we hope to answer any questions that you might have. If you have questions or require additional information, please feel free to contact Gasco toll free at 1 877 427 7347 or through our website at gascoonline.com. So in this series segment, we will be discussing what is a gas regulator, why are they used, and where are they used. Gas pressure regulators are a simple device. They're used to reduce pressure on the inlet side that is elevated down to a lower pressure on the outlet side while maintaining the needed volume or capacity for the proper operation of downstream equipment. So where are they used? They're used in boilers, industrial ovens, bakery ovens, water heaters, generators, kilns, rooftop units, makeup area units, along with many other places such as hospitals, restaurants, factories, and even your own home. So what are the basic types of regulators? We have the simple spring, which under the simple spring we have a lever and direct acting. And then we also have pilot operated regulators. So under the lever acting, you're going to see some examples here. The Maxitrol 325 series, the Census 496, 143, and 243C3 series. What are the elements of a lever operated regulator? Well, it has a valve, a disc, or plug that works in relation to the orifice. It has a sensing element, or the diaphragm and it also has a loading element, or a spring. It uses this lever to gain a mechanical advantage and provide a high shutoff force, or simple machine lever and fulcrum assembly. Another advantage of the lever acting design is that they provide increased force for lockup without the extra cost, size, and weight associated with larger diaphragms, diaphragm casings, and associated parts. We now move on to our direct operator, which still fall under the simple spring. You're going to see some examples here of our Pietro Fiorentini Governor Series, our Pietro Fiorentini Deval Series, the Maxitrol 210 Series, and the Census 121 and 122 Series. There are also some essential elements of direct operated regulators. They still have a restricting element is a valve, a disc, or plug in operation again in relation to the orifice. They have a sensing element, or the diaphragm. They also have a loading element, the spring. It does not have a lever assembly though. It works off one stem from the sensing diaphragm to the valve seat pocket. It's typically used for higher volume applications. And also our direct acting regulators are our fastest responding regulators. And as you can see by the picture of the cutaway, that it does not have a lever assembly, it works in relation to a, a stem assembly. So moving on to our pilot operated, which is literally a regulator operating a regulator. They're used in applications where we need a higher outlet pressure, or where we have increased or larger capacities. But they give us better performance, pressure stability, and accuracy especially for high pressure applications. They have greater accuracy, especially for our fixed factor measurement. If you have questions or require additional information, please feel free to contact Gaskell toll free at 1-877-427-7347 or through our website at gaskellonline.com.